This is Charlene Meadows with your News in 90 update for Tuesday, March 9th. Thanks for joining. Two people are dead following a crash in Tampa this morning. The crash happened around 1 a.m. on Interstate 275. A police officer and a civilian died after the civilian struck the officer's vehicle. The 25-year-old driver was going the wrong way. Tampa police officer Jesse Madsen was 45 years old. He worked on the force for 16 years. People gathered across the country yesterday for demonstrations to mark the beginning of Derek Chauvin's trial for the murder of George Floyd. In Jacksonville, a small group of protesters called for the conviction of all four of Minneapolis police officers involved in Floyd's death. They also rallied for police to have more accountability and transparency through civilian councils. One of the changes to come in Florida in the wake of Floyd's death is the release of body cam video. Instead of waiting months, body cam video and officer-involved shootings are released within 30 days. In other news, Nissan is recalling more than 800,000 vehicles to fix a brake light problem. Officials say silicone contamination from grease and nearby components can cause oxidation. This can make the stop lamp switch near the brake pedal malfunction. If that happens, it will not light up and the engine may not start. Owners will then see a malfunction light on the dashboard. There have been no reports of any crashes or injuries caused by this problem. Dealers will replace the switch at no cost. That's your News in 90. I'm Charlene Metters. Your Florida News is always on at WUFT dot org.